In the rat race of the modern world, time is money. So it pays to be fast, real fast. The fastest runner, the fastest puncher, the fastest to stack plastic cups. But it's not just people's speed either. The fastest car, the fastest boat, the fastest machine. We're always looking to go faster, and world speed records are smashed on an almost daily basis. As we run quicker, think smarter, and build bigger, boys and their toys just keep getting faster. If the hand truly is faster than the eye, make sure you don't blink or you'll risk missing out. Ready to witness these world record speed demons in action? Let's get it on! Fastest Rubik's Cube it's safe to say that the majority of people who attempt the Rubik's Cube are never able to finish it. Plenty of peeled off stickers in an attempt to cheat, but Ke Jun Yu is a Chinese student with multiple world records under his belt who has never been one to do things the easy way. He's completed the puzzle while hanging upside down, using both hands and his feet to solve three cubes simultaneously, as well as solving three while juggling them in the air. No doubt, he's the pinnacle of what is humanly possible with regards to a Rubik's Cube. All of this pales in comparison, however, when compared to this purpose-built cube Cube crunching robot. Using just 21 moves, two cameras, and six servo motors, it can get the job done in a blisteringly quick 0.38 seconds. The beauty of engineering is that you can create a machine that really excels at a singular purpose. There isn't any other function this robot possesses other than being the world's best at dominating a Rubik's. See, we told you, blink and you'll miss it. Solving in three, two, one. Fastest money counter. Wang Dongyun is a Chinese banker, and also the fastest money counter in the world. He's gotta have the nimblest, most dexterous fingers in the game. Watching his hands work in a blur of movement is reminiscent of the automatic bill counting machines. Chinese tellers are old school, and have to practice their counting skills every day to manually dispense large volumes of currency. Amazingly, he can count over 200 banknotes accurately in 30 seconds while blindfolded. He uses sound rather than feel to keep track of the number counted, and is able to use anywhere from 1 to 5 fingers. Fastest pit stop. In Formula One racing, the difference between first place and second can be fractions of a second. It makes sense then that refueling and tire changes during a pit stop need to be done as fast as humanly possible. Even shaving off a millisecond each time adds up over the course of a race. Pit crews are as important to the racing team as the engineers, mechanics, and even the driver. This group operates like a well-oiled machine, with each person performing a specific action. They practice over and over until they have perfected the art of the pit stop, getting it done in as fast as 1.9 seconds flat. Fastest Puncher Pavel Trusov is a real fighter, and no joke. He's been kickboxing since the age of six and holds multiple Russian championships and titles. Not only are his hands powerful, they're also officially the world's fastest. He trained for six months specifically for the Guinness World Record attempt through incredible pain and fatigue. He was able to deliver 322 full extension punches in a minute, which is well over five strikes per second. Only a fool would enter the ring against this guy who floats like a hummingbird, stings like a bee, and throws his punches so fast you won't see them coming. Fastest Talker John Moshida Jr. is well known for appearing in many commercials and TV shows in the 80s. His gimmick? Being able to talk extremely fast. Tongue twisters are mere child's play when the nerves that connect your brain and your tongue conduct impulses as quickly as John. He's made a career out of this totally unique ability and is able to formulate 11 words a second from his lips and is the embodiment of the term motor mouth. As a result, he's held this mantle for over 40 years. In old age, a shown no signs of slowing down this vocabulary speedster. Peter Piper picked a pickled pepper, anyone? Bad, you know I'm bad, I'm bad, you know, you know, bad, bad, really, really bad, you know I'm bad, I'm bad, come on, come on, you know, bad, bad, really, really bad. Fastest boat. Tyler Spear was tasked with holding one of the most insanely fast boats straight and true while a fire-breathing monster of an engine propels him along the water as quick as lightning. The engine is something you would find in a top fuel dragster. Weeks of preparation and building is needed to hold the nitromethane-powered beast together for just one pass of the course, covering 875 feet in just 3.2 seconds at a speed of 227 miles per hour. The boat uses an astonishing 17 gallons of fuel per race, which pushes out in excess of 10,000 horsepower and needs to be completely torn down and rebuilt in between events due to the intense forces of combustion. Fastest Skateboarder 
Kyle Wester is not your average skateboarder. You won't find him cruising along the beachside pavement or performing tricks while vaulting in the air above the halfpipe. This man feels the need for speed. He prefers to don his crash helmet, protective leathers, and careen down a hill at speeds faster than a car traveling along the freeway. He recently smashed the world record hitting 89 miles per hour. To put it into perspective, a crash at this velocity would be the equivalent of hitting a cheese grater at speed. In other words, one big ouch. Fastest Skipper Sin Shaolin's obsession with skipping rope began when his school decided to encourage the students to skip to keep in shape. After just three years of training, his speed was so incredible that he caught the attention of the people at Guinness World Records. He set new records with 108 skips in 30 seconds and 548 skips in three minutes. To give you an idea of just how fast this is, the officials had to play back the footage in slow motion eight times to verify the number of steps. He's earned the nickname of the world's most powerful thighs and can go as fast as seven skips per second. Fastest Snapper Clicking your fingers has been a measure of speed for as long as time has been recorded. Japanese student Satoyuki Fujimura is the world's best according to Guinness, able to snap his fingers an incredible 296 times in the space of a minute. He was a bit of a late bloomer, having only learned how to snap his fingers at the age of 15. After years of dedication and practice, he can now safely say there is no one better in the world than him. One thing is for sure, this is the man you want at your table when trying to get some service and the attention of a waiter. Fastest Side Wheelie Stunt drivers can perform death-defying feats of skill so daring that most of us are just happy to be spectators and never attempt anything ourselves. Getting a car up on two wheels is crazy enough, let alone attempting to break a speed record while tilted on such an angle. Vesa Kivimaki is a Finnish driver who did the impossible when he got his BMW M3 up to 116 miles per hour using only half the number of wheels the car was designed with. In the ultimate snub to Isaac Newton, he defied both the laws of gravity as well as the laws of motion during his attempt. Best to leave this one to the professionals. Don't try this at home. Fastest time to smash coconuts. Opening a coconut isn't all that hard. You can use a drill, a hammer, a spike, or a saw. Generally, if you have the right tool for the job, you can crack the sucker wide open. But what happens when the only tools you have are hands of stone and rock-hard determination? Abish P. Dominic is one Indian who proves that where there is a will, there's a way. He's able to smash through an astounding 122 coconuts in just one minute. His huge muscular arms and powerful fists make short work of the hapless palm tree fruit, sending slivers of white flesh, brown husk, and clear juice every Everywhere as he makes his way along the production line like a man possessed. <laughs> Fastest on all fours. As a toddler, we have to learn to crawl before we can walk. There are some people, however, who feel more at home down on all fours than they do standing up on two feet. Kenichi Ito can run the 100-meter sprint faster on his haunches than most people can while running upright. He's the world record holder, able to race down the track in just 15.71 seconds. His style looks remarkably similar to a horse's gallop, as well as wearing athletic spiked footwear for grip. He has custom-made heavy gloves on his hands to protect them during a race. My question is, what the hell?